the decline of the Ottoman Battle of Gaza. Mission 13 without generals. I have completed the game for a few days now and to keep myself busy I'm trying to play as many missions as possible without the generals. Let's see how we fare. <clears throat> Again this is just a, a regular campaign so you just need to capture the key points. One, two, three. Okay, I see here a mean, a mean tank, a field artillery, another tank in the bottom, but I don't remember this mission. <clears throat> Sometimes you have additional units that just pop up, which really upset me. I hate when this happens. <clears throat> remember my philosophy, always hit something. When you move, try to hit something first. Okay, no generals. But I can just put a bit of a medical pack on this guy. Let's invest. The city, what can I do? Mm. Princess could be good. Other either like reduce the cost of cavalry. For the future now there's no money. Uh, population is good. Military academy, why not? It's some blast. Okay. No want to lose time. Don't want to waste time. The Sipali, as you may remember, when you kill an enemy, they regenerate their strength. The problem is that often you don't get the next shot. I'm not sure if I should invest in medical kits for this carolade. Because it's a pretty crappy unit. Let's see, with this money I can invest in a hunting cavalry. And breastplate, but I don't have much industry, so you see, I should have invested in uh, <clears throat> industry because I'm not generating enough. That's what I'll do when I conquer this city. Also, let me do some more blast. Remember, when you use the blast, use them all together when you are ready to attack the city because the city regenerates. Very tempted to attack first this guy because the field artillery has, has no shield, so you can really destroy them. It's pretty slow. Okay, I better go with the hunting cavalry for now and produce lots of them. Four turns. One more blast. Check the fortress. Three. Okay, I think we, now we can conquer it. I'll go for it. Oh, this is out of range actually. 
and this one 267 it's a lot so I need to rely on my artillery Eighty four, that's pretty good. I'm gonna hide the artillery there. Okay. With the carronade. And that's it. We conquer it. Now let me see which is the best option is this okay what do we have here first thing i go for industry then i can upgrade the city now 267 Okay, I'll put some pressure there. This city is lost anyway. I'd rather have a <coughs> some strength, resources. Okay. Should probably try to support I should probably try to support these poor guys. So, I decided to be selfish actually. One eighty one, a green jacket rifleman. Let's see. <clears throat> I will sacrifice this. Okay. Because artillery is pretty effective against other artillery. And so new infantry. I really want to get this guy out. Now, where were we? Okay, I don't have enough. Okay. So no more fortress. We have a light infantry. Seventy seven. 48 left. Okay, we got rid of this guy. It's good. And then let's attack there. Breastplate, maybe we can try, ah, this one is too expensive, 
between the breastplate cavalry and the hunting cavalry, the difference is minor, especially when you don't have generals, because generals have a multiplier. So, no problem. Now, something smart to do is to surround it. To reduce their morale, still 145. No, no chance. Hmm. Let's upgrade the industrial zone. Okay, there is a slight surrounding of that city. It's time that we take this one. What happened to the tank? The tank got killed. That's a very good news. I killed the other general. So, there's no more fortress, I need to kill 63, which is done, and I guess I will put this guy, oh, already won, how weird, unexpected, well, thank you for watching.